hey guys, this is Lindsay from darkprovance.com. Today in this tutorial we'll be learning about rendering in posts and the main focus on this is text. There will be more things into posts but we're just going to do the main thing with text and I'll just tell you a little thing so let's get right into it. So basically everything in the code starting and finish will be in the description so check it out so you can don't have to write it all so I give you that little treat but um I found when you open the opening um like left arrow or whatever you want to call it Tumblr closes it but when you close it it won't make a double thing so that's a little cool feature with uh, Tumblr now so basically to render in a text post we need to use the post tag and that's curly bracket block column capital P post and in that column curly bracket and then as usual we have to close the block post with a forward slash um, basically this will render in the um, anything it will tell Tumblr that it's post but Basically, I'm just going to fix up the alignment so it actually looks cool. <laughs> it makes it easier. So, um, basically, to render in a post, you need to do the text tag, and that goes curly bracket, block, column, capital T, and text, and then curly bracket it off. And as usual, just the forward slash to end that text thing. <clears throat> Sorry about my voice, it's been a bit sick. <laughs> but um, basically, it won't show anything when I do update preview. It is because um, it doesn't have actually have anything to do. So um, we're going to do the title of the text post. So basically, you do curly bracket block, column, title, curly bracket, and... Basically, we're just going to close that off again, as usual. And we're just going to um, refresh it. Um, for some reason, I don't know why, I saved it um, <laughs> and checking it out. But um, it won't render in anything because we actually haven't told it what the title is. Okay, so um, basically just press enter again and press tab and we're gonna go opening arrow a space href equals two apostrophes and we're gonna write in curly bracket perma link and then curly bracket that off and basically this will be the um the link to that post and because we've done the block text and that and the closing of it it will only do the permalink for that, you know, text. Close off that, um, the link tag and write in title. And basically, that title won't be the title to your actual page when you do the opening arrow title and closing that off. They will be different because, um, we're rendering it as a, a block text. So, um, just please note that, um, that it is different. So, when I press update preview, it should, um, update. But, um, basically, we're just going to make the text a little bit bigger because it is a title. Um, we're just using the H1 tag, which will be in the later tutorial on my HTML coding. So, um, let's just update this preview and it will say an example post which is um, with Tumblr that Tumblr does it so I'm just gonna save it and refresh my page and this is a title and when I click that um, it will go to the actual post settings so basically you know follow reblog delete edit and love heart and go to your dashboard so that is the official you know like link of that specific text so um basically we're going to go edit html again and we need to have the body of the text 
So basically we're just gonna have a div tag and we're gonna go opening arrow and go div and go id equals to apostrophe and have text and basically when you have your CSS sheet it will every text post will have a text CSS sheet just close off that div tag so we so we don't forget and we're going to write curly bracket and write body but with a capital D um, basically this is the body of the text it is only for that text post so you know that's the good thing about um, Tumblr so you don't have to write it every single time but this is the body of the text as known with a post with Tumblr so basically that's the whole code um, basically the blog post renders or tells Tumblr that we're making posts and that block text will actually say to Tumblr that we want our text to show on our web page. So thanks for watching guys. On Zs out.